back to The Sims 3 all in one. Really quickly, I just wanted to tell you guys that I had to drop them out of university and play an entire week of them in university again because it was not saying that they had made their they're great. Like they were just never ending in university. I'm a little bit concerned because it says that he's about to receive his report card, but she has not received hers. But her little situation here is yellow um, for her degree, which it was not before. So I'm hoping that everything is going to work out because I'm getting a little bit stressed out. I don't know why it's done that because I've never done that before. Or this has never done that before. Okay, so it says Adrian Voss Communications A, Eli Nash Communicate or Fine Arts A. So I assume that means they both graduated because she or are going to graduate. She didn't get a little prompt to say that she's receiving her report card. Oh my god, but she's going over there to compliment his appearance. Like, girl, like, what is your major issue? Like, seriously. Uh, so hopefully this will kind of work out. I played through all yesterday because I was able to play offline, but you cannot film with OBS offline. So, oh my god, she wants to freaking woohoo with him. Okay, you know what, girl? You need to, you need to slow down. Look at her flipping that pizza over there. All right, the final grades are in for Eli. Now she earned enough, he earned enough credits to complete his degree. And she also got the same little wish there. So that is really exciting because I was kind of scared. Oh my freaking God. Can you guys keep your damn hands off of each other for two seconds? Because I don't even know what is going on. What is this guy going to tell us now? He looks super angry. So we have totally different housemates. Um, and I also worked on her uh charisma while I was playing off camera I worked on this so that we could like try to be everybody's best friend and kind of you know like these little whatever these like the skill journal um I always like to do this I've tried it recently and it's kind of cool because you become friends super quickly with people which will be super helpful but we've only made four best friends so we need to have 10 best friends so maybe we can work on that while we are at home uh, so I don't know what this guy is going to tell us, but I think we graduate around 12 or 1, and I told you guys that we need to get to the stadium, so I'm gonna have the two of them. Oh my god, Eli is faithful to Adrian, Eli has a faithful reputation. Wait a minute, Adrian is faithful to Eli, uh, what? They're not even together. Are you kidding me? Okay, I don't even know. Like, you guys want them to be together so badly. But when we get home, Adrian is going to have other things on her mind. Uh, but you guys are killing me. You're like, please just make it happen. Get them together. It is so funny. Uh, but, you know, Adrian, Adrian's got some things she's got to do. So her and Eli, oh my god. Her and Eli, if they do end up together, it's probably not going to be for a little while because I want to have her work on her little master romancer. Oh my god, but they can't keep their hands off of each other. Maybe he can talk her out of it. Maybe he'll be like, listen, oh my god, they're insane. I need to sell this before I forget because one of you guys were like, don't forget to sell the hot tub and thank you because... You know, we're not, we're not leaving our money here. We're going to take that with us. Uh, they just are insane. Um, but we live pretty close to the stadium. So I kind of, I don't know if it's 11 or 12 that they are supposed to graduate. So maybe I'll have her kind of come here and then have him kind of come here as well because I want to make sure that we don't mess anything up because I am so concerned about that I should have asked you guys like what traits that you think we should have had them picked because they get to have an extra trait since they graduate um and I really don't know so why don't you kind of go over here and then Eli will have you kind of go over here as well when you get here Maybe you guys can kind of talk. Let's just be friendly. Let's be, let's be friendly. Why don't you enthuse about music with her? I love how it says that they're faithful to each other when they're not even together and they're both cheating on their significant other. Like, what kind of crap is that? 
Uh, listen through about comic books. Um, let's see here. Maybe we can ask him how his day is going. Okay, maybe it's 1 p.m. I'm going to kind of speed past this a little bit, but I want them to be here. Like, I don't want them to leave this place because I've had it happen a million times before where they miss graduation because I don't know if it's just because it was on my old computer and it took them forever to like, oh my god, ask you to break up with Sasha. Are you serious? No, don't insult her. Oh my god. Are you serious? Oh wait, did you insult him? I'm so confused. Can you maybe not do that? Why don't you be funny? Make a silly face. Uh, I, but my old computer... Oh, he's like not feeling it. Not feeling it. Go ahead and apologize to him because... Seriously, what is your issue? Okay, here we go. University graduation. But it took my... Uh, on my other computer, it took them forever to change into the robes. Like they'd be standing out here forever. And I think that that's my problem is I'm just so paranoid. What is it? Slytherin and Gryffindor? Like seriously? I would think it would have been the other way around. Uh, I'm a Slytherin, by the way. Um... <laughs> So we're going to speed yeah. past this. Oh, we're going to zoom out a little bit because that is loud. But I think I'm just like having like PTSD from, no, I'm just kidding. But I feel like I have flashbacks of my old computer and like the problems I had and my Sims taking forever to change. And then they would get stuck here. But with this computer, they change pretty quickly. So I just need to like calm down and not, not worry about it. But I do. So... <laughs> All right, so let's see who's gonna graduate first. Uh, it looks like maybe Eli will, but they're about at the same time. All right, because Eli Nash earned a degree, he can now choose another trait. So, what should we have him be? Mm -hmm. I just don't know what we should have him be. Should we make him like family oriented, a genius? I don't know. I'm trying to see if there's anything that would be like helpful for his job. Maybe a schmoozer? Star quality, but no, we don't really need star quality because we don't we're not gonna have him be a celebrity. Um maybe we'll make him a schmoozer. What do you guys think? Should we do that? Um, I'm trying to check really quick and see if there's anything. I guess he could be a party animal. I mean, he kind of did become a freaking party animal while we, while he was here. Um, let's, yeah, let's just go ahead and go with, with Schmoozer, I guess. Because I don't really see anything else. I mean, he can schmooze his way, maybe? I don't know. We're going to go with that. And she gets to choose a trait as well. Let's make her... We can make her ambitious or what else can we do? We can make her a hopeless romantic. I could help her maybe with her master a romancer, but although a hopeless romantic, you actually want to like find your true love. I feel like she does want to find her true love. She's just kind of in a weird, weird area right now. Like she doesn't know what she wants to do and she doesn't trust anybody. So you know, she could be a workaholic. Let's make her a workaholic. Let's make her a workaholic. Mm, yeah, I think we're going to make her a workaholic. There we go. So they both got their their degrees. Where are they at? Are you going to toss your diploma? Go ahead and toss your diploma. I thought I thought you'd do that. Go ahead and toss it. Oh, I can't believe university is over. Like, wait a minute. You need to toss your diploma too, my friend. You're not going home just yet. You're not going home just yet. You need to toss yours too. <laughs> Can you maybe congratulate her? Yeah, go congratulate her on get on gathering, on graduating, and we're gonna have her do the same to him. Oh my god, that is so funny. I seriously, when I see these, I think it's Slytherin and Gryffindor, and he's like, oh. Oh my gosh, they are so cute. They are so cute. Okay, we're going to go ahead and let them go home. And another thing I've learned is it'll tell you that 
you're going home tomorrow, but you are going home at 8 p.m. tonight. So I want to throw a party, but I don't think we're going to be able to because it is already almost six o'clock, which means by the time we get home, yeah, it's going to be pretty much pointless. So let's see if there's any mail or anything that we need to kind of, okay, there's some mail and let's see, maybe we should have them apply for extra funds again. Can we do that? I don't think we can because they're not, woo, because they're not here anymore. Okay, we can't do that because I was going to have them apply for extra funds just for some some extra money, but that's okay. Is there anything at the house that we need to sell? Um, I mean, I guess we could sell all the things we bought, which is this. Oh, we can't pick it up. Um, we bought this. That way when we go home, I mean, we bought that too, but we'll leave that. But we purchased that as an extra. Um, we purchased these guys as an extra and this as well. That way we kind of get our little bit of money back before we leave. Now I know I could probably sell this entire thing and I'm not going to do that, but we purchased those couple of items. So we're going to go ahead and do that. And why don't we have you kind of do a keg stand with Adrian and then maybe Adrian can do a keg stand as well. Um, we got something from Scott McLemore. Dear Adrian, I can tell that you're a very special person. If we didn't take the chance to get to know each other, I would regret it forever. Okay. Jacob Salomon, I know this might surprise you, but I'm crazy about you. I think we should get together and see what happens. Derek Khan, I know this might surprise you. Same thing. Okay, this dude, Muhammad, is all about Eli. Okay, keep an open mind for a sec while I paint a picture. <laughs> you and me together, how does that make you feel? Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Derek, again, I find you attractive, but couldn't tell you in person. Derek is super cute. I love him and Jacob Solomon, but Jacob Solomon is kind of an asshole. Just saying. Just saying. Okay, why don't you go ahead and do a keg stand with Eli? We'll, we'll do a little bit of a keg stand before we head home to etc. Yes, etc. He wants to become another. Okay, improve your cooking skill for sure. See a concert? Yes. Look at him over here tapping his foot. Boy. I want you to move so that she can actually have her little keg stand moment. So there we go. Let her have her moment. She wants to also have a little bit of a keg stand here before we head home. All right, one hour until time to leave for home. Wrap up those last minute goodbyes and start thinking about enrolling to come back next term. Well, we are officially done. Oh my God, there is a cop car out here and I think it's been out here since like ages ago. Uh, we are officially done with university. Who is he going to go scare? He's creeping up on somebody. So that means we're gonna have to focus on some other expansion packs since this is all in one and I've never watched an all-in-one let's play at least i don't think so uh so i don't really know how people really go about like focusing on different packs but we um pick a spot in town and create street art we can probably do that when we get home actually that's going to be here in university so let me just go ahead and scratch that or is it actually going to be home opportunities okay we can just do it when we get home uh so yeah, let me know like what you guys would like to see me focus on as well. I definitely want to focus on her story a little bit more. I want her to work on her master romancer because that is kind of, you know, a big part of this situation. Um, listen to story, listen to complaints. Everybody is coming over to like tell us all these things that we do not care about. Uh, can you stop? But let me know like what pack you guys would be interested in me focusing on next because university was obviously one I wanted to work on first so that they can kind of get their job and like establish you know their job and the money situation and whatnot so I mean I don't know if you guys want to work on pets or generations or what like I said I don't know how people normally go about it in an all-in-one actually no I'm lying I did watch Jessamica's all-in-one let's play and that is an amazing let's play and I miss her so much on YouTube because her videos are so good uh, but yeah, she is the only one that I've watched an all-in-one Let's Play. I totally forgot about that. Okay. What are we doing? Are we not going home? Because if that's going to happen, I'm going to scream. <laughs> if we're not going to go home, I'm probably going to scream if they don't. Like, can we just leave or are we going to have to drop out again? Because I don't want to have to drop out and do this all over again. Oh, 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 okay. Travel home, travel home. Okay. So what I'm going to do is they're actually going to travel home, which is perfect because I was getting a little bit concerned because it was past eight o'clock. Uh, I'm going to let them head home and I will pick up when we get to Cetra. If it is late, then I will pick up that morning. 
you know, you know the drill. So I will see you guys in just. All right, guys, we are back home, and it was almost midnight when they got home last night. So I went ahead and let them sleep. Our girl is having a fantastic time dancing, doing what she's doing. Now, when we got here and they woke up, they both got the reputation of being naughty, which is so weird because they just got the reputation of being um. What the hell was that? Faithful. Uh, I think he was singing. Uh, he broke the toilet, so we're going to let him fix the toilet. So what I want to do is have them get their jobs. So we're going to have them upload their resumes. So let's go ahead and go to jobs and offers and upload resume. And what did we want her to do? Oh my freaking goodness. All right, let's go ahead and check up on the job. Let's see what kind of money we can make, first of all, since we have... Look at her. She's like, yeah, I don't know. So we have journalism, 190 simoleons. Political, 135 simoleons. Did we want her to be in journalism? I feel like we did. Am I wrong? I feel like it was journalism. She could be a political woman, too. I can't remember what I originally wanted her to be, but journalism, she will make more money. So we're going to go ahead and accept that career, which means she will be quitting her job as a spa specialist, which, yes, indeed, because we need more money. Become friends with someone. She needs to level up her writing skills. So we are on level four in the journalism career, which is super exciting. Let's kind of look and see who our boss is. So our boss is Harold Natalis, and then we need to get him to... <laughs> He's over here looking so dang mad. We need to get him over here to... Go to jobs and offers and upload his resume. And now I know we wanted him to be in a band. So that is kind of the plan. And she also wants to throw a party. Girl, we just got home and you're already about to throw a party. Like, did you not get enough? Did you not get enough? Now, let me know what you guys think we should do with uh, Muggsy and Sasha being in university. Should we have them both just kind of break it off? Um... All right, so film, 130, small ends, culinary, 140, music, 145. So that is perfect. That's what we wanted him to be. So he will be a band manager. So we're going to quit our bookstore clerk job. So that means he is a level four in the band. So let me know what you guys think we should do about Sasha and Muggsy. Now, they were like super romantic at first. And then all of a sudden, it seemed like towards the end of the university life, they were, what are you going to do? Make silly face. So they were like not so much into their significant, significant other. So do you think we should just break it off? And that was like their college romance. And maybe, you know, maybe um, Eli could like find somebody around here. I definitely want to work on Adrian's... Uh, why is my game like all of a sudden like slowing down? I don't know what's going on, but it's like being super strange. I don't know if it's like, what's going on here? Uh, but what I wanted to do is work on her little lifetime wish here. So let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. What should we do with their significant other? Should we just break it off? Should we just say, you know what, we're done here. That was just like a little university, you know, kind of romance, but now we are moving on. Or should we move them here and continue on with the romance? I know that you guys are really wanting Eli and Adrian to be together. But like I said, right now, they're going to, you know, she's, I want to do this mas master romancer thing. I really want to get that little wish done. Uh, so I don't see her settling down just yet. I could see Eli wanting to settle down, but I don't think that she's quite ready yet. So let me know your guys' thoughts in the comments down below. Leave a like on this video if you guys are enjoying it. Subscribe before you go if you've not already, because the closer we get to 3k, the more we get close to the giveaway, which I cannot wait. So yes, I love you guys so very much, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys. Yay.